Hey, Mari. So you have a question about head cannons, and I always have to preface this by saying head cannons are great, uh, and I never want to shut down people's head cannons. Uh, I'm not going to be talking about uh, my head cannons for Oscar and Ozpin, but let's focus on your head cannon or, or the head cannon that you've brought to me, which is uh, Ozpin as potentially a father figure to Oscar. And I think there are ways that I, I could totally see that working out. I think, you know, uh, fan fiction writers have tons and tons and tons of opportunity to dive deeper into their relationship, um, particularly over uh, like volume four. Oscar and Ospin spend a lot of off-screen time together. And, you know, unfortunately due to the constraints of that volume, we weren't able to get into a lot of it. But if fanfic writers really wanted to explore this kind of relationship, that's where I would really start. You know, Oscar is still um, at home or, you know, at his, at his aunt's home where he, where he lives. And um, I think there's a lot of opportunity to bring up, like, feelings of past homes and, you know, Oscar's original parents um, and maybe filling that void. Um, yeah, I think that's a fun headcanon to play around with. Uh, I think it could lead to a lot of wholesome situations. Um, and I would love to see people out there, you know, playing with that sort of dynamic, playing with that prompt. I think it's a really great one. Um, so yeah, I, I hope you enjoy my answer. Again, of course, I can, I can never share canonical stuff. It wouldn't really be fair to the rest of the Ruby team. Um, but in regards to this specific question, I think it's, I think it's a really fun one and a cool, uh, dynamic to explore. So I hope you enjoyed my answer and I hope you have a wonderful day.